Hello and welcome back to my studio. I hope you're well and Melbourne and Victoria I'm thinking of you all. I, I hope you're staying safe. Today we're going to do another big piece on uh, paper. Often people talk about the big scary white canvas or paper. Uh, I, I've luckily never found that to be a problem. My advice would be pick your favourite colours and just put a wash over it to knock off the white and have something that's your favourite and something that you love and see if that helps. Uh, the other thing is to always be keeping a visual diary, jotting down, sketching, painting ideas, uh, which will help you perhaps not arrive blank to a blank surface. Anyway, let's have some fun, get some colour on this piece. Oh, and stay tuned to the end. I'm going to pop some footage in of the birds. We get, I'm um, in a rural area, so we do get lots of magpies and rosellas and uh, blue fairy wrens and all sorts of little finches, gorgeous animals. But mostly, I think in the background of these videos, you can hear my neighbour's birds. And I've taken a little footage of them this morning. So you have a visual of what you're hearing. Okay, let's get stuck in. say is to keep it light first layers so you'll be able to see what what goes on top if you start too dark uh, it'll be get quite muddy and you'll find it hard to see uh, you'll have to work all in highlights straight away anyway let's do some more
Okay, and here we are at uh, maybe the finished piece. I didn't like where I was going. I was trying to make them less abstract and more realistic petals. And I decided I didn't like it, so I sat with it for a while and started to paint over it. And I've given it a little bit of a gloss, as you saw, just to help lift those acrylics that dry a little bit flat. You can use that to your advantage, of course, and not, not gloss some areas and leave some areas flat so they'll fall back. It'll give you a bit more um, dimension in your work. But uh, anyway, here's some little hydrangeas. And I hope, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you'd like to see me do more videos more often, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up for my videos. That helps promote my channel and uh, helps me give up my day job <laughs> and be in the studio and with you all. So go well, see you next time, bye.